A very rare sight in West Michigan today. A black bear running through a Grand Rapids neighborhood and climbs a tree. An hours long effort follows to get the animal down and keep the people watching it safe. News Channel 3's Jason Poor was in that Grand Rapids neighborhood today. He is live now with more on this big bear scare. Jason. Andy, this bear is a wild bear. It did not escape from the John Ball Zoo. Officials don't know how the bear ended up on the west side of Grand Rapids. As they tried to coax it to come down, police also had to keep gawkers away, eager to check out this unusual sight. I see it. I see it's moving. It's all the way up in that tree right behind him. See that little like, black area? Yeah. Kind of by the chimney up there? Uh-huh. That's it. Mom, are they going to bring like it over? There's a buzz growing on Dayton Street, and it's not from any bees. Oh, it's moving. Neighbor Mary Jean Hansen says it's incredible. 51 years. Never had a bear before in the neighborhood. That black bear climbed his way into a tree after police caught him roaming around Grand Rapids after hours of waiting. The bear didn't budge. I can't believe it's happening here. I do. Where would it have come from? He looks big yeah, from that picture. Officials are guessing the bear's weight at 125 pounds. He was just kind of hanging out up there. He wasn't really like coming down. Like he was really scared. Obviously. Yeah, he was scared of all the people. Um, they waited for him to like climb down, but that wasn't happening. So then they tranquilized him and he fell asleep in the tree. The DNR tried to use a rope to bring the bear down, but he fell into a net and was then put in a trap. Neighbors say there was nothing to fear. I'm safe in my house. <laughs> as soon as we get in there. <laughs> yeah. The DNR says it will take the bear north and release it back into the wild. Coming up at six, you'll hear more from the people who woke up with this bear in a tree over their heads. Live in the newsroom, Jason Poor, News Channel 3.